Hello everybody, Great Steel Blaze, and we're back with more Landless. So this game has gotten another huge update. This this developer is like a madman. That's like, what, like five or six updates in like two weeks? So now, they have completely, hold on here, fleshed out the city. To the point where now, there's like people that walk around, you can kind of talk to them and stuff like that. Oh, hi there, epic music out of nowhere. Go inside, there's dudes to sell stuff to over here. You can buy a bunch of stuff from them. In fact, I might even buy like some fish because we're gonna need some food. Buy raw potatoes and stuff. Um, what do you have? Sulfur, raw fish. We have a ton of money right now. I'm gonna show you guys why. Now, a couple of things happened um, off camera and it wasn't my intent to have it happen that way. It just did. For some reason, I recorded and it did not record the sound to the game. I, I don't know why. But it didn't. So anyway, we have a tavern over there. Or not a- actually, I think it is a tavern. But it looks more taverny over here. Look at this, we got like slabs of steak on plates. We got like meat and cheese trays over there. Got your modern art piece. It just looks like a bunch of scrap or something like that. I really don't know. Up here though, you always gotta look. Because every once in a while, there's boxes. And in the boxes, we can grab stuff. And still, to this day, no one cares that I've been pilfering the living hell out of their things. Yeah, right over here. I'm gonna grab all that. Get us some extra gun uh, ammunition in there. Have it. Now, we have a lot of ammunition. In fact, we have a lot of everything. I had so many shotguns, I had to sell them. That's where a lot of my money came from. That's why I'm freaking stacked with cash. Uh, over here, look at this. We got the hotel. Look at that, the freaking letters are all sideways and everything like that. Let's go check her out real quick. The N with the dragon on the, or not the dragon, that's a freaking lion gray. Holy Jesus. With the lion on the front. We can sell some things that we want to. Yeah, the shotguns go for 5,000 whale oil, man. So that's where, uh, that's where all the money's coming from. One of the things I learned though, is while crafting in this game is a pain in the testicles. What you can do to alleviate some of the the kicks is the quests or the missions or whatever you want to call them. Like one of the things I needed was batteries. So I took up a bunch of quests and now we have all kinds of batteries. Oh my god though. We are like full up on damn near everything. Okay, I can fit that in there luckily. Look, I can barely put any of this stuff away. So we do have a ton of fish. Uh, one of the things I'm actually going to do with this is we need to cook all this fish. I think we can cook five of them real quick. We'll go ahead and get the burner on and make those so we can get some food in our stomachs. Right now, we don't have a lot of food on us. Uh, but we have so much money that buying food is like totally trivialized right now, which is fantastic. I need to find where my freaking houseboat is. Go ahead and eat all this. Uh, ah, what the hell, I'll eat the last one too. And then we'll drink a couple of these right here. We have a ton of water because it's been raining like damn near constantly. Let's go ahead and biofuel the living hell out of our boat here. You can see right now our boat's going up. Our buoyancy is way down. I made myself a bilge pump. It doesn't really appear to be doing very much. Um, some other things that we could do is we could make ourselves a better generator. I, again, I don't know what a lot of this stuff does. You can pause while you look through this, by the way, with the tab button. So, over here under machinery, engine is what we're using to run the boat. Generator is what we want for the generator so we need metal frames metal pipes i happen to have some processors done wires and then a battery and i happen to have batteries as well so i think what i'm gonna do is get this generator done and like see what it does so pipes frame bracket wires let's freaking do this all right we got the wires going over here now if i remember correctly i think we need 20 wires and 20 brackets again what i wish you could do is that you could like just click on the item and it would take you to the item page. But right now, we're having to do it the old-fashioned way. Oh, that's interesting. It saved 20. All right, well, whatever. 20 brackets. 20 of those. We'll get that done. And then I know it's two pipes. And I don't exactly remember how many frames it is. It may just be one. All right, we need one metal frame, it looks like. Can we get a better generator, I wonder? Uh, more pipes. More batteries. Let's just do the single generator right now. So we need one metal frame. And I think that's in the processed materials. Yeah. Right like this. Okay, so one metal frame, and then we'll be able to have our generator. What does the generator do? Hell if I know, but we might as well get our boat freaking stocked out as best we can. We're going to want to get it, uh, the hull fixed as well. We got like a hole in the hull right now. I don't know if that's doing anything terrible to us. Probably. 
Probably. All right, what do we got over here? Come here, buddy. There we go. All right, generator, basic generator, craft. There it is. Oh, it's getting made right now. It costs five whale oil, but we got a freaking ton of whale oil on us, so I'm not even worried about it. This is going to free up a lot of our space, too, which I'm pretty happy about. And then maybe we'll go do some more of the tasks. Because like I said, doing the tasks is a fantastic way of getting crap done. So generator, blam! Right there. What does it do? I don't know. Um, nothing appears to be happening right now. Force, rate. Oh, it increases our force and our rate a little bit. Uh, ampl All right, so that goes up by one. And then the buoyancy goes down by 50. Okay, very interesting. All right, so I say always take five missions if you can. By the way, when you complete the missions, all you have to do is just go into your uh, little area and then just, like, get her done. And that's all that happens. Just go back to the radio and you can get it done, like, immediately, which is friggin' sweet. Um, so our inventory is looking a little bit worse for wear. I've got to see if I can find out where the hell our houseboat is. Let's get out of here while it is a beautiful day and see if we can find some things worth killing. We need to kill drug boats. Uh, and we need to, I need to eventually kill seagulls, but I feel weird about that. I feel weird killing my own people. Every once in a while, people are like, Gray, why do you say seagulls are your people? Like, one time I was like, oh, I don't want to eat a, se a seagull. That's cannibalism. And they're like, cannibalism is when you eat someone, something of the same species. And I'm like, yeah, you don't understand, though. Like, I have been designated as a, as a signal, as a, a, se a signal, a seagull. And as such... Any negative actions I take towards seagulls, people know about. What is this? There's an object over here. Oh, there's a buoy that just popped up out of nowhere. I think that this is just like some driftwood floating around. Hold on here. Let me go find this out. What are you? Odd wooden log? Can I grab you or? Oh, just scrap wood. Scrap wood just kind of ran laying around. All right, very good. Let's go over this buoy. Because buoys always drop. What the hell was that? Is that? That is a boat with some bad guys on it. Oh, crap. Where's my shotgun at? There it is. Put that over there. There we go. Man, these guys are damn near coming right up into my boat. All right. Now, you want to kill You want to kill the driver first. Bam. Bam. Right there. Because if you kill the driver first, they can't move their boat away. If you, if you kill the gunner first, the driver will try and get up out of there and you'll lose all your stuff. Give me the loot. Give me the loot, you scumbag! I think I saw a piece of loot over here, did I? Oh, I guess I didn't. All right, let's go ahead and grab it. Right over here. Wow! Oh, survival supplies. That's one of the uh, that's one of the items I'm looking for, by the way. So let's continue. Is that a drug boat over there? See that thing right there? Right there. It looks like more impressive than the average boats. I may go check that out. It definitely looks more impressive than normal. Where the hell did the buoy go? There it is. All right, let me go ahead and beat the crap out of this buoy, and then we'll uh, we'll go check that out. Maybe we'll maybe we'll kill them. Oh, they may be a traitor as well. It may just be a traitor hacking away with the axe. I don't know what does better, the the uh, crowbar or the axe. I know the axe looks better. You know what I mean? Like it looks like a higher quality instrument of destruction. That's why I use it. I can't believe I'm not getting shot at yet. Well, also the guys in this game have really really bad aim. Um, so it could be that too. All right, cool. That's down. Let me go ahead and jump on out of here. Climb up. We'll wait for the black box to appear. As a matter of fact, I may have stuff right now on me that I can get rid of. Can I get rid of this wood? All right, I can get rid of that. Got some rifle rounds. Man, we are full up on everything else. I got to start selling some of these extra rounds and stuff like that because we just don't need that many of them. All right, let's go ahead back in here. Make sure to grab our black box. There we go. I've got like a whole freaking slew of them now, man. I got black boxes coming out the freaking wazoo. All right, right over here. We've got fuel. I can put that over there. Black box goes right over there. And we have a little bit of extra space. All right, let's find out what the hell that boat is. I don't know if that's like a regular dude that's okay with us or what. Ahoy! Oh. Whoa. Holy shit. Okay, they are blasting the hell out of my boat. Bam. Bam. Oh, man, they have a freaking turret on their boat. What else am I getting shot by? I don't... Where's it coming from? I don't know where the shooting's coming from. I can hear it. I just can't see it. Ah. Oh, there's a dude. Ow. Son of a bitch. All right. What the crap? 
I can't fully hear where it's coming from. Hold on, let me let me wander around. There it is. All right. Hold on, we are beat. We are beat really bad. Actually, hold on. I think I have a. Uh, I think I have a medical kit laying around over here, don't I? Come here. Come here. Where are you? There we go. All right. Where's my medical kits at? I got one right there. There we go. Uh, close that out. Do one of those. There we go. Now we're back at full health. All right, scumbag. I've had enough of your freaking crap. Where's my freaking shotgun? All right, you freaking bastard. There you go. You didn't even blast. Can I take your boat? Because your boat is really cool. Is it going to sink of its own volition or what? I don't know, man. Let's go check it out. Hold on. Can I board it? Um, I don't know if there is a ladder anywhere around here. I mean, maybe if I bring my boat closer. Hold on a second real quick here. The moon has come up. We have found. We have found a scumbag. And they are, in in fact, a dastardly, dastardly scumbag. All right, here we go. Let's see if I can jump into their boat. Ready? Huh. Ah, there we go. All right, we did it. So can I get down here, I think? Whoa, I just went right through the boat. Right through the boat. Can I slap any of you people? Maybe I can take the boat down. All right, I guess it's just a scumbag's boat. I can't seem to sink it or anything like that. That's kind of interesting. Um... We're gonna have to get some. What the hell is this? It's like a freaking pipe that went right through my. Uh, oh, it's the water catcher! Ha <laughs> ha! All right. Um, I'm gonna have to catch some Z's in a second here, but first, let me go ahead and get a little bit of fishing in right over here. Little bit of fishing, right there we go. I think I totally missed a fish. We need to get some food. I'm gonna get something to drink, and then I'll see you boys in the morning time. All right, I went to sleep. The flaming wreckage of the boat is still right next to me. I don't know what it takes to blow it up. But I found out what the drug boats are. Um, there are like some really, really fancy looking boats in this game that look like very impressive and powerful. Those are the drug boats. Uh, they look a lot better than our boat. But we do have to hunt some of them down. We also have to hunt down uh, salters and some other stuff. And we press L. See our various items here. Uh, kill 15 salters. So I think those guys are pirates, not there. That's the drug boat. It's a really, really cool looking boat. And if we kill a bunch of seagulls, look at the crap we get for that. We get just a ton of rounds and damn near everything else. Oh, oh I think there's an orc out here. Oh, there is. Oh, the orcas are worth so much whale oil. Oh, it's like a school of orcas. Holy crap. All right, let's grab one. Hold on. Got one floating around right over here. I'm going to pull up right up next to him. Right like that. Get out of this. Grab our gun. Oh, we have a light on our gun now. I didn't know that. There we go. Whoa. You ever wanted to get super close with an orca? It doesn't seem to get pissed off as long as you don't shoot it. But we are going to shoot it. Oh, are we getting attacked by a friggin' shark too? Well, whatever. We just blasted everything. Sharks. Whales. Doesn't matter what it is. Doesn't matter who you are. Gray will whip your ass in a heartbeat. Crane is occupied. Let's go and get that whale oil that we so want. Yeah. I think it's, what is it, 800 whale oil? We're going to get some raw meat for this over here, this freaking shark over here, which is quite nice. Hold on. Let me go ahead and line this up. There we go. Line her up. And look at that mouth open. Look at that big old mouth. Shark's mouth looking at me sideways. That's what you get, shark. Now your meat. Now your food. I was actually pretty fortunate to find that shark because we're going to need food. Um, fishing is definitely a way to get food. It's just a pain in the ass. I'd rather get food like an easier way. I am eventually going to have to go back to town and buy some Cthulhu. Cthulhu is actually used for something. I can't remember if I said this or not because, again, I had to re-record this. So I may say some things that I'm doubling up on. Is there something following me? Hold on. Or is that an orca? Let me get my gun out for this crap. That looks like a whole friggin' slew of sharks. That's a whole slew of sharks. Crap. Come on. Low, 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 low. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hi, hi. All right. Yep. Nope, 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 nope. Holy crap. Holy God. Oh, my God. There we go. There's one. There's two. Man, these friggin' sharks, you're all gonna be food for gray today. You're all gonna be food for gray today. There we go. All right. Well. I think we're... What the hell? Are you serious? 
There! Die already! Crap! How many freaking sharks? Look at all the sharks! We're freaking tripping on these things! How do I turn this light off? Oh. Oh! L is not only the contract log, it's also the light. I got it. Alright, so we have to go off of that to turn it off. There we go. Alright, let me see if I can... It's time to hook up all these sharks. Oh my god, there's freaking sharks for days. Sharks for days. How come I can't get the shark? This is odd. Alright, whatever. There's a ton of other sharks over here. Hold on. Back it on up, boys! Back it on up! Shark number one, you, sir, are getting cut into meat. Shark number two, you are gonna be freaking breakfast, if ever I did see such a thing. There we go. Shark number four, have you found Nemo? You have not, and thus, you are now going to be seasoned with garlic salt and cracked peppercorns. Lash- Whoa, 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 What the crap? What's going on with my boat? What is going on with my boat? Holy crap! My boat almost went freaking sideways or something like that. I've never seen that happen before. There we go. All right, last shark. That was interesting. The boat almost capsized. I know our buoyancy level is like freaking crap right now, but Jesus. Uh, oh wow, we have, oh yeah. We've got cooked shark for days. We got cooked meat too. Let me go ahead and cook all this up and get something to eat and then we're gonna head on back out. All right, we're set. Let's go find us some damn drug boats. I want to see them drug boats. We need to take two of them down. I don't know what it takes to take them down either. Like, oh, hold on. Did I just see something out the corner of my eye? Oh, it's like a raft or something like that. Now, is this a regular Joe Schmo raft or is this a problem raft? Every once in a while, there's a problem raft. I don't know where our houseboat is as well, like the beginning to our houseboat. I know it was on the outskirts next to a raft. You, sir, be ye friend or foe. I'm assuming you're a friend. Because usually the tavern music means that you're gonna be just fine. Go over here. And then, old Gray's not that good at aiming up. So a lot of times I end up taking a little dip. All right, what do we got? Nope, we got a box. Inside the box, scrap electronics and wood. All the electronics and wood. How about over here, sulfur and fuel. All right, that's fine. I can't even grab the sulfur, I'm totally out of space. Where's there a guy at? There should be a dude over here somewhere. Oh, even more scrap. Oh my god. I have so much materials on me. I gotta figure out what to do with it all. There's no one here. We just went straight into this dude's house. We jacked all of his crap. He's gonna come home and be like, not again! It's me. It's the same guy. I've been stealing all your stuff for quite some time. Let's get back into our boat over here. Alright, continuing to move outward. We got another buoy. I'm actually gonna leave that buoy go. I want to see if we can find a drug boat and then take it down. Was that a... What is that over there? That's an orca, I think. I'm starting to get used to seeing... And that is a shark because it's coming right at us. I'm getting used to understanding exactly what it is that's coming for us. How do these people in these tiny little dinky ass rafts survive when there's like sharks everywhere? Like these sharks hate me with a burning passion. Like they desperately try and kill my ass. And a person on a raft, there would be no way. There would be no way for them to survive. The friggin' sharks are pushing my my giant orca boat around, the old uh, jaws boat around. Been driving for a while. We got a lot of fuel though, so I'm not worried about it. Like we literally have a ton of fuel. I wonder if there's like an end to the map. Like how big is this map? I know the game I think is procedurally generated. But, like, what happens when I reach the end? What is that over there? See that right there? Bunch of items in the water. Hold on, let's go check this out. It looks like there's random items over here in the water. I don't know if they are something valuable or if they're nothing. Let's go check this out. Yeah, look at this. Looks like there's crates. All right. Now, I think that there was some sharks following us, too, but they don't appear to... Nope, they're still there. Hold on. Gray's got to take care of business. Suck on it, shark. Suck on it long time. All right, let's go check this out. Do I get out of here? Ugh! There we go. Uh, nothing. There's nothing. It's nothing. It's a lie. What is this? It's a waste of my time. Nothing in there either. Oh, there's a, there's a, um, there's a houseboat out there. Uh, do I even want to kill you, shark? I don't even think I, I don't have time for your crap. Let's go check this out. There is something right out here. You see it? Maybe it's a trader or something. Maybe we can sell a lot of this scrap and stuff we have because I have so much crap on me. We've got to get rid of some of this. Ah, this is definitely a trader. Um, all right, what else do I have in storage over here? Can I sell a lot of this crap? 
I have all the all this freaking ammunition. Like, what am I gonna do with it? Same thing with the sulfur. I don't know. Let me see what he has to buy. If he has like some good stuff that I need, like again, batteries and things, I may just go ahead and oh hi there, buddy. Come here. Come here. Let me get there we go. Man, these people are either really tall or I'm really short. Um I wanna sell all this. I just don't have time for it right now. I've got so many items on me. Here, you can have all that. Uh, there's a bunch of scrap wood. You can have there's 160 of those. I got a ton of friggin' scrap wood. There's no reason for me to carry all this around. Uh, what else you got on you? You got anything good? Cthulhu. Yeah, we need some of that, actually. Um, I'm going to buy 2,000 worth because we're going to need that to um, build up our, uh, our whatchamacallit, our, um, our hull. So, what else does he have over here? Wooden floors and stuff like that. Hmm. I may, I may use that. I don't know. Hold on. Let's, let me patch up my boat real quick. So, you go over here to Hull Epoxy. And then you go ahead and you cook yourself up some, or, uh, well, you're not cooking yourself Cthulhu. You are using Cthulhu in order to have Hull Epoxy. And then you need, I think, the wrench. And if you beat your boat with the wrench, uh, I think it uses up the Hull Epoxy. And you can see it does 15 points each one. So, we're not really going to have that much. We're going to have four of them over here. All right. Well, whatever. Uh, inside the storage. Give me my wrench. I'm going to put that in number three, I do believe. Can I keep that in there but have it on me? Oh, I sure can. Holy crap. That is good to know. Um, oh, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Now, we're at 920 out of 1,000. So, good. At least we're getting somewhere on the hull. Uh, we could even buy more if we wanted to. Do I have anything else I could sell this guy? All right, I'm gonna sell. I'm gonna sell all of this sulfur. I'm gonna sell all of this as well. All these pieces of scrap. And I'm gonna sell the wood, and then we're gonna get out of here. All right, we're good. Moving onward, heading directly away from Leavenworth. But yeah, man, the updates to Leavenworth are looking freaking sweet as hell. I love it. Looking good. Freaking houses. Cause it's starting to get. It's like it's like Skyrim on water. You know what I mean? And the thing, it's just like a little tiny dev, too. I really appreciate that they are, like, working the hell out of this game. What is that? Now, is that a scumbag boat? Or is that a decent human being boat? That looks like a decent human being boat. That is probably a trader. Yeah. Right over here. I'm pretty sure that is a trader. Now, I wonder if he has anything good on him. Hold on. I'm going to talk to this guy real quick. You have anything cool on you? You got some Cthulhu as well, do you? Uh, and then some food and some water and stuff. No, nothing really good. There's a buoy right out there. Hmm. We can take that buoy out, but again, we've done a lot of buoy hunting. I want to find a damn drug boat. Oh, we got dudes on rafts. Dudes on rafts. Hold on. I'm gonna take these guys out. Ready, and get you. Get you. There we go. They're down. Anytime you come near one of these friggin' buoys, these bastards spawn all the damn time. Now, they may drop something good. So, killing them isn't actually a bad thing over here. We are getting really tired. We're going to have to go sleep in a little bit. There we go. There's their delicious loot. Let me go jump overboard here in order to grab it. And we got some more rounds, which is actually very, very fortunate. I got the rounds back I used on those guys. And then some. Oh, we got a drone over here. Drone. Bam! Didn't even see it coming. I think that the drones drop like a little box or something. Every once in a while, I see it appear... Um, it appeared on my boat the last time, though, so I don't know if it's gonna appear on the boat. It was, like, right on the ground over here. It actually appeared on the ceiling, and then it fell on the ground. Uh, yeah, there is one. Look at this. What do you have on you? Oh, a battery! Oh, that's so good! Again, the batteries are such a pain in the righteous... Ow! The hell was that? Where's the, where's the bullets coming from? Look at that! I'm getting shot at from somewhere, I just don't know where. There we go! Found out who's shooting me. It's those guys over there. I think we're just gonna flee from right now. Man, these buoys are freaking everywhere. Man, there's dudes all over me. There's, holy crap. All right, hold on. There we go. That gets, that gets rid of that guy. We got a drone right over here, too. Take that down. I think we've leveled everything at this point. Can I grab, can I grab your stuff right now? Look at him running away. Yes, run with your freaking tail between your legs, you loser. Where's that box at? There it is. Getting all the battery from it, too. Oh, there's a dude there. There we go. More batteries, man. I don't know where my water bottles went. This is very odd. Did I end up selling my water bottles or something? Now, luckily, we've got what I believe is a little trading hut right over here. 
So we can go hit this real quick and buy up some water bottles. You can see my thirst is like really, really down. Once you have water bottles, it's like you can fill them super easy. It's not a big deal. Um, so I'm not worried about it. I just need to have them on me. There we go. All right. Go ahead right over here real quick. Open up yonder door. I know you're in here. There we go. All right, buddy. Let's do some trading. Let's do some trading right over here. Oh, there's a little, a little light starting to come out. Dude. Dude. Buddy. What the hell are you doing, man? There we go. Oh, yeah. Give me some water. I'm going to take 10 waters. Thank you. It is a beautiful new day. Sun's out. Gun's out. I'm hoping to find some guns anyway. I'm hoping to find these freaking drug boats. Um, way out there is Leavenworth. So we're going to continue to head away from that. Are those sharks or orcas? Those are orcas because if they were sharks, they would already be all over us. I'm going to let them go, but right there is like 2,400 whale oil just sitting there. Looking delicious. Ugh. It's hard to let it go. Been traveling for a little while. Sun's coming up over here. Nothing but me and the open ocean. A couple more of those buoys as well. Again, the buoys are good for getting like loot and stuff like that. But I've killed a whole lot of them and I just want to see if I can find some other stuff. Um, but with all the batteries that we've gotten and all the items that we have, we can actually think about continuing to craft uh, other upgrades for our boat. Get like a new propeller. Maybe like a better engine. A better engine would probably help. I wish I could figure out how to get our buoyancy up. I don't know if it's because our hull is not patched up all the way. But like normally our buoyancy was at like 50%. And now our buoyancy is absolute crap. It is like as low as you can get. It actually, there's no number next to it anymore. It's so low. It doesn't even assign it a number. Been driving myself silly. I think there's a hydro turret over here. I think, yep, sure is. We can take it down if we want. I don't know if it'll give us anything. Let me go ahead and load up. Load up. Right there. Bam. Hydro turret down. Are you going to drop anything for me? More batteries is always worth it. More batteries is always worth it. I think, it, I think everything drops stuff. I think as long as you blow it up. What is that out there? Is that another buoy? It looks like another buoy. Um, did you drop anything? Hydro turret. Maybe you didn't. All right, well, cheap bastard. Been driving for a long ass time. I found this dude over here, which is good because we're going to have to refuel. Um, and I think that this guy should have plenty of fuel for us to buy. And I think we may go ahead and save here as well. May try and kill some of those seagulls because um, we're really going to need to do that at some point. So I can, what the hell? I know what this is. I know what this is. I know it. Freaking sharks. It's a freaking shark fest over here. Yeah. Open that mouth of yours, you scumbag. Can I lean over? Hold on, let me see here. If I can, there we go. Yeah. Is that all of them? Anyone else? Anyone else want a piece of gray? No? Good. Good. Freaking ho ass sharks. Oh, my inventory is full. Okay. Well, with a full inventory and a boatload of freaking sharks and damn near everything else. Go ahead and drink all this. I think we're probably going to call it... Crap, that's not what I want to do. I think we're probably going to go ahead and call it a day. Let me open up some of my inventory sp space so I can actually make all this shark meat over here. Go ahead and grab all these sharks. There we go. There's one shark right over there. Well, might as well get them all. Might as well. Hold on. Let me go ahead and swing the boat around. Don't worry, sharks. Got room for all of you. I got room for all you sons of bitches. There we go. There we go. Yes. I got, we got three sharks. We got breakfast, lunch, and dinner. That's their new freaking names. Because that's going to be their purposes. There we go. Man, I'm getting good at backing into sharks. Let me tell you something. All right. Head over here to the old cookery. Raw fish. Make four of them. There we go. And we all be set to go. The only problem is I don't have a place to put it. I don't know where it goes. Um, when I don't have a, oh, good. It's going right over here. Excellent. Yes. Go ahead and eat all this right now. There we go. Good. Good. All right. That's going to be good for now. We're going to catch some shut eye. We are starting to upgrade our boat. We got the bilge pump. We got the engine. We got a generator in. A better crane is next, as is the radio and stuff. We could probably get a better engine as well. Maybe we'll go faster. Hope you guys are enjoying Landless. Kind of an interesting little open world survival 
all on the water game. I'm very curious to see where the developer is going with this. He says in a month and a half around, we're going to have custom boats. That's what I'm looking forward to. We can start building our boat out. It's going to be freaking awesome. Hey, folks. Hope you enjoy it until the next time. Stay foxy and much love.